Hello everybody, I am Bratman19 and welcome to episode 21 of our Polish campaign in European Universe 4. As we are heading for uh, three achievements, the One King to Rule, uh, the Poland Cannon to Space being the major one, and then the Winged Hussars achievements. And I will say uh, something that I have mentioned to the stream already, so this might sound a little echoey to them. We were really worried about not having packed a Conventa and trying to force it to occur. Well, I went and did some poking around and asking questions, and turns out, you know, Pacta Conventa has some negative effects to it. And one of those is to have reduced inflation of, uh, you know, by plus 50% for the cost. Well, there it is right there. As you can see, Pacta Conventa plus 50%. I have gotten it before. Now, the only other thing now is just to make sure that I have, uh, you know, wait, I have to wait for the next part, which is supposed to happen within about 100 months of 1600 starting and maybe it's just the age of absolutism you know things have changed in this and nobody really quite knows so we're trying to gain as much absolutism as we can get uh, for this as well so actually we already have multicultural nature and that's awesome unfortunately we did not win the religious war but we also were not you know we didn't actually really join that um Just taking a look here. Universities, trade companies. Okay. Seeing what was out there. Um, anyways, though, we're we're just going to kind of focus on doing what we do. Um, and that's kind of hoping that that 100 you know, year meantime, our manpower gains, some treasury uh, gains. And then I'm going to go to war with Venice at some point. I really do want these two. So hopefully we'll get them. Oh, Austria is calling me in in a war against... Um, Hamburg and Munster. I don't know if France will join, but Venice is out. No, yeah, Venice is in this. That's right. Let's go ahead and pull this guy here. Send this one here, or send him here to Athens first. Now, the idea is that hopefully we will not waste a ton of manpower and helping this one along. I uh, Let's lose some inflation, lose that stability. There's nothing about that stability hurting or helping us, so let's see. I really wanted... Yeah, I really do want this province for myself, but he's going to get it. That's ours. Looks like his navy is going to get in place. We'll go to Epirus. Come on, come on, get there, get there. Yes, nice, we're here. I can send these guys to come save him. Not get caught, we don't want him getting caught, right? Russia joined, oh my gosh. One of the things I did not want to have happen, I didn't even know Russia could join in this. Hmm. Well, we're gonna have a hard time, I feel. Of course, we do have more. We have about the same manpower and all that, so maybe we can deep strike Russia. I don't know. I don't really have the manpower to fight Russia. Let me just start. Yeah, let me get one of these done. Austria, I'm going to have to kind of leave you on your own here. Munster and Hamburg, like you guys are going to have to really knock that out for me. He's at 7%, he's at 100. We need to get this done very quickly. Now he's going to sit here and try to block, keep that blockaded. I don't think he'll... Yep, there we go. Quickly grab that. Siege of Corfu is now over.
They're going to try this stuff up here. Hopefully we can get out of this before they make me have to do anything. Of course, just beating Venice is enough to win. It should be enough to win this. Let's go here and take Naxos real fast. There it goes. I think our morale is better, but I'm not sure of that. He has more manpower than me, I do know that. Something we should do, I mean, knocking out all these extra little guys would be very... Uh, very much in my favor to do. We're actually losing that right there. I don't know why. Why did whoever did something? Somebody moved around, did something they shouldn't have done. Yeah, Austria's not playing very smart right now. He's not exactly split. not running. They took Smolinks just as I was coming on to it. You're kidding. I mean, we whooped them pretty hard there, so let's try to take that back. Let's kind of... Let's engage his armies and hopefully we'll tire them out. And getting them out of this war is going to be... Huge. Uh, he's got too many friends nearby. Let's back out just in case. I'm going to come up here and go help that. I don't think Austria has the morale to fight him. He does not. Oh, we've already got Smolites back. Let's go for this. Let's go here. Who did he, who did France put on the throne and all anyway? Or how did, yeah, Portugal and Trier. All I have to do is attack Trier and Portugal comes in. I could literally destroy the HRE pretty quickly here. Killed that. If I could pick off anybody. Defeat, Memengen's out. Yeah, no, that's not a good plan. Hamburg, Munster, and Russia. Let's go ahead and send those guys up there. I mean, we got to do all the work ourselves, I'm guessing. I wish I could do, you know, my. I wish I was the one that could have declared this war. Because we're about to take some of their, ca their territory and Moldavia is coming along to help. We're at 7% here. Negative 57. It's probably it's a level 5 fort. Our guy's greedy. Okay. 7%, 28%. We do have that wall breach on Moscow. Converted some people to the one true faith. 0.78 that. I need you guys doing more than just that stuff. Um, gain the stability that we lost earlier. 42 and 14. Let's quickly win here. Fifty-seven and twenty-eight. 
Could lose money, get army professionalism. Riazan gets... Hmm... There's nothing I can do that's going to let me not lose prestige. We don't really care about the devastation to Ryazan either. Is that 42%? How's Russia feeling? Still good. We just don't have the manpower. The carpet sieging him should go fairly well for us. Um... Yep, they got Riga. Yep, took him out. Let's look at heading that way. Our cause is just aggressive expansion, expansion minus 20%. Immoral prices. I can't afford it. Uh, afford to do anything else. Russia's not feeling it. Hamburg's feeling it. Let's go right here. Take over that. We could probably go to Munster next. Austria's way off over here, so he's not really helping his own cause. There goes Hamburg. Where is Munster? Oh no, I have to come back. Forty-two percent. There goes Yaroslav. Oh, let's come down here. Ooh, he's actually having a pretty good battle. Let's go on ahead and hit here. We're gonna have reinforcements. Piskov's over. Let's go on for Novgorod. Yeah, Russia's starting to feel a little bit of this, but we're also we're in low enthusiasm, so pretty sure Austria is getting there as well. And Venice is probably feeling great about this war. Huh, medium, he's got high war exhaustion. My war exhaustion's kinda high as well. kind of focus on some maybe some higher development provinces or something stay here a miracle of life we get minus two to war exhaustion let's take this enables leather cannon Take that, and enabling galleots. There goes another group, of, uh, another bit of group idea or group of ideas, whatever. Um, hmm. Quantity or defensive? I like defensive. Morale of armies is great. Um, but once you get past that, I mean, it's there's some reinforcement speed, land attrition, land maintenance modifiers. I think quantity is better. Leather I mean, cannons don't make up a large army anywhere, so losing that little bit of morale is not a bad thing. 
We're at 7% for Munster right off the bat. Maybe we can knock him out quick. Go over here to Calm. Munster's out. Now we got to come down here. Help out our allies. Let me check the ledger. Uh, da, 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 for army qualities with my war enemies. Venice. And they both don't have very good mil uh, morale. He doesn't have as good vin uh, all that. Okay. Venice, what are you sitting with? You have some manpower. Russia has the troop numbers. Which they're somewhere. I don't know where they are. Maybe down here. If we could hand a defeat to Venice and start taking those that stuff back, we might be in better shape. It's at fourteen percent. Russia has fallen out. Russia will cede Kaluga to us. Let's pull these guys back in here. I want to pull all my troops back. Nope, I need to keep going back to here. Let's go ahead and add Kaluga. We've actually beaten Russia. For the first time ever, we've beaten Russia, and we kind of did it on our own. Uh, us and our allies did it. Very proud of that. The struggle for royal power. Here it goes. Of course it would happen now. We could resign completely and read theological books instead, so we'd lose 100 prestige. We'd change to a republic, and we really wouldn't get what we wanted out of that. Or we can get Commonwealth, get the royal struggle into the royal struggle. Uh, gives the following effects. National unrest plus 10. Yeah, so 48 magnets, 27 magnets. I mean, it'd be pretty hefty, uh, pretty hefty of a problem. Let's get these guys to Warsaw. Where's the other spot? In Trenson? Where is Trenson? It's actually right there. Let's see if we can swap sides. Go, 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 go. If you're going to turn left... Nope, you're not going to turn left for me. There you go. Fighting with the nobility. Can't let them have Warsaw for sure. Ooh, that just drained me really bad. Um, let's go ahead and boost that stability. That looks good right there. Um, now we have a minute to wait here. Let's do this. National Manpower Modifier goes up, so maybe we can... Uh, Quickly gain more. Go beat them. We they didn't end in defeat, but they better not give them any of my stuff. Yeah, Austria's got to give stuff over to him, like Istra, but I don't have to give anything up. So fine. Oh, he just got barely a little bit. Come on. Come down here. I need to start moving. I need to move men closer together. We got to get ready for this to get really bad. This just happened at the worst time. I mean, I get, uh, you know, Taco Bowler is telling me it's a, it's a, in chat that it's a very fun um, event, but or fun disaster, but uh, right now I just don't have the manpower to fight it. This dude just does not want to give up. Die, man. There, finally, there's a win. Okay, let's pull you up in here. I 
gonna pull all these guys together. I'm just glad it finally happened. Everybody together, let's go get them. Competent cousin, if we ever had doubts, they are long forgotten. Now we get 10 prestige. We've got to beat the nobility here. We have tons of morale. The morale is no longer really a problem. It's is all manpower from here on. Thank you for getting that done. Let's send you to Warsaw. Let's send you to Trenson. Let's send you to Noah Sox. And let's hope nobody fires in the meantime. There's Commonwealth Particularist. I mean, who knows where they will come from or where they will go to exactly. Okay, um, hold shift. It's just shifting and consolidating troops. I mean, they form with so many across, uh, four, across four places. We lost the Darnay. I mean, Moldavia, can you quit doing what you're doing? I need the help. I guess he's not going to really be that helpful to me. Hmm. I mean, I'll let Sir, you know, Sarkaja go through, but it's not going to do me any good, I'm sure. Pull these guys all together. I mean, we're not going to put them in some super mega... We'll put them in a mega stack, kind of. But they're not going to be very good like this. Brandenburg. I wish I could bring my al I could tell my allies like, hey, I need help. Like you don't want your main ally having, you know, being hurt, right? I would rather go fight these 38 when they are on when I can pull out a garrison. Uh let's put these on yeah, Tropicis. It'd be easier. Ooh, he could have caught me right there. There's more rebels. I mean, they were just huge stacks. Go fought those. The best thing that can happen is that they get stuck on forts. The longer they're on forts, the easier it is for me to get there and build up my forces, all that good stuff. He's feeling better, like he can come help me. You're going to go up there in that mountains. Now you don't even have a commander. Let's send this guy down here. Come on, beat him. Yeah, we got way more than he does. We'll let Moldavia handle the rest of that. We're going to come up here. Really, not that many men in my under my command. Pull them around. 
Uh, we could lose some money or gain legitimacy. I'd rather have that unrest go down a little bit more. That's fine. We'll lose the money and get that. I could go and I could mark up too. I do know that, guys. I'm pretty sure somebody is calling me out for noob mistakes like that, but it's not really a mistake. I'm trying to do this all on my own. Whoa, why do you think you got to go that way? National unrest. More things to help with that. Man, national unrest area went up like 10%. Adarne was taken. There's an extra 3,000. He's finally going to come in late. Okay, let's send these guys off to the south now. Hungary's at 90%. Hungarian separatists who are down here anyway. I oh, know they're over here. Um, Toronto is 5.5. .5. It's right here. I mean, we'll do this. I mean, until, you know, we get rid of that royal struggle thing, I mean... Okay, Hungary, is there anything still? No. Albanians, Vlor, and Lezi. Okay. Biggest thing is I've handed the, bi the bigger ones. Alright, let's continue on. Alright, actually, let's go ahead and end this one right here. So we're now in the middle of the you know the huge power struggle. If we can win this thing, we drop the session. We'll get our and we'll have to just I think gain some absolute absolutism to get our achievement. Um, but it should be really fairly simple. And this guy right here, he's going to be exhausting himself doing this over and over and over. Um, on that go, guys, I think we'll just kind of continue going and hope for the best. So, all right, guys, appreciate y'all so much for watching. Do not forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Maybe check the link for Discord in the description below as well as check out link for Twitch, and I'll see you all next time.